Hey everybody, welcome back to Toy Notes. You're sitting in the Toy Notes studio with me, Kelsey, as always. Today we're playing with a really cool toy. This is a little live pets toy, and it's kind of playing off the hype that came from Hatchimals, like to be able to find a surprise little chick inside an egg you hatch yourself, because this is the little live pets surprise chick house. And you don't know which chick you're getting. You can hatch it over and over and over again. And then it kind of has a teaser on the package. This right here says, will you find the limited edition golden chick? So I think it's kind of cool. You're getting the best of both worlds with a little live pet set, which kids love. And then you're also getting that kind of surprise factor that kids are dying for with all these blind boxes, mystery bags, surprise eggs, and all this stuff that's been going on in the market lately. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get it opened. So I brought my scissors out, make sure I can make quick work of this because I see lots of uh, little rubber bands holding this in the package. So there's a piece of tape here and here. So we've got our instructions for use and then there's a bunch of these twist clips in the bottom. And there's one, two, three, and four. Okay, so I've got the main unit out of the packaging. Now the egg is secured in there as well back of this is, does open. I know it does. There we go. Get some rubber bands out. And then there's these cardboard clip ties. I'll show you. See these like thick paper cardboard ties? It looks like you can untie them if you have the patience for that, but as you well know, I don't, so my scissors make quick work of irritating things for me. So, <sighs> really got this secured in there, I will say. Okay. To damage my egg at all. Okay, so there's all the packaging. Now, it says you have to remove a piece of tape on there, but I don't want to do that until I've read the instructions. It says, hatching for the first time, pull the pull tab packaging lock. Okay, so let's see here. On the bottom, there's a little twist clip. Why don't you come down in closer and we'll hatch him together? All right, so our instructions as I was reading go one through three, and it says that when you're hatching for the first time, you have to follow these instructions exactly. So it says there, you've got a pull piece of tape and a pull clip. Now on the instructions, it says that we're going to pull both of those, the pull tab first and then the packaging lock. Oh, you can hear him. There's one more piece of tape on the back here that has to come off as step three. So he's hitting on the egg. It says, now place the egg in the surprise chick house by pushing down onto locator pin. Now there's a little pin inside the house. You see it kind of sticking up right here. And then there's a matching spot on the egg. Ooh, he's trying to hatch on me.
he might be having a hard time getting out of there. Aw, look at him. Aw, look at this little guy. So it says you can free range plane like this. See how his beak is moving? He is soft and fuzzy like a little chick. It says your chick loves to be pet. Gently stroke your chick's head and it will tweet. It will eventually tweet a tune the happier he gets. I don't see him responding to that. Okay, there he goes. So that was the tune. <laughs> so it says that to turn him off, there's an on and off switch, and on, switch on his belly right there. And he will fall asleep on his own after 20 minutes, but he will try to get your attention every few minutes until you do pay attention to him. So far this is adorable. Now it says you can hatch him over and over again. So the egg isn't destroyed or anything. Oh, it says place the egg on a flat table surface, open both sides, slide chick's feet all the way into rails and base of egg. Okay, it says, press down on his head until he locks in hatching stance. Come on. Okay, I think that means he's locked because he made a clicky noise. Oh, come on now. Okay, and then you can put him back in here on the locator pin and wait for him to hatch again. You can hear him clicking. Woohoo! There he is again. Well, little live pets, you surprised me today. I'm in love with my little chick. I love this set, it is so cool. It's very well done. This little guy is just the cutest ever and I love him. I love that you can make him hatch multiple times. You get that kind of surprise egg, surprise hatching thing that kids love so much. And you get to collect more of them. There would be more that would fit in this or other play sets. Um, there's multiple ways to play with them. I mean, it's just super, super well done. And I'm very, very, very impressed with this one. So if you have a little one who loves little live pet sets and was super crazy about hatchables, 
This is a very inexpensive way to replicate a very similar playtime that's quite frankly done, it's done differently, but it's done better because they get a little bit more than just that first time hatching. Hatchimals was all about the, what are you gonna get in the egg? But with this one, you actually get to replicate that fun over and over and over again, which is kind of nice. So guys, if you wanna be here for more awesome toys like this little live pets toy, make sure you hit that subscribe button and check us out at toynotes.com. But until next time, bye.